Ministro, autoridades, eh, alcalde, rector, un saludo para todo el mundo. Muchas gracias por haber querido venir aquí. Muy buenos días. Good morning. I first of all would like to thank the Cancer Research Center for hosting us today. Your work with the University of Salamanca and CSIC has been remarkable and long-lasting, by the way. Happy anniversary. Felicidades por esos, por esos 25 años. I also thank the Spanish Association Against Cancer for organizing this event. And of course, allow me to recognize the work of different entities and researchers who support our shared goal, preventing and conducting research on cancer, being more effective in its treatments, caring for patients, and giving them a more powerful voice. And why? Because everyone, even before potentially becoming patients, should be at the center of research and of concern by our healthcare system. So the key word is prevention. I think uh, when you talk about the, the your motto is so pertinent, cancer research needs us all is, is very important. Moreover, patient experience transforms technological innovation into a human innovation and ultimately improves medical effectiveness. What we are talking about, what you are talking about, is a more inclusive research, one that leads to more effective and humane treatments. In our complex and rapidly changing world, global priorities may equally shift, but that does not necessarily apply to certain empirical realities, like cancer remaining the second leading cause of death worldwide, the first last year in Spain. Accomplishments and strides, of course, are numerous. This center is, is a good example. I have just been uh, to several of your labs where you are working on how to improve the diagnosis and treatment of cancer caused by mutations in specific oncogenes, where you try to explore deeper into chemical mutations in RNA or study the genetic basis of myeloma in the field of hematological cancers. However, we know that this is continuous today to spread faster than our knowledge. That is why equitable and secure funding remains vital, ensuring fairness and transparency both in the distribution of resources and in the access to results as well as in guaranteeing the basic right to healthcare. It is therefore more than worthy to continue investing in research, in technology, in services, and above all, in talent, without forgetting how crucial it is to invest in prevention. As we hope that, the, that those of you who work in oncological research may access the means to continue doing so and share your knowledge as you are about to do here today. These spaces for dialogue are truly important because in order to make true progress, science also needs to listen and to be heard. So keep going and thank you very much. Muchas gracias.